Hey everyone, welcome to Mahalo Daily. I'm Veronica Belmont. Now, there's tons of different kinds of gourmet food. There's gourmet pizza, gourmet ice cream. You can pretty much find everything under the sun. But have you ever heard of gourmet coffee? Yeah, you've probably heard of Starbucks and things like that, but I'm talking super, super gourmet coffee. And here at Funnel Mill in Santa Monica, California with JC, there is some really kind of very interesting coffee that you guys sell here. Yes, we do. We carry from your basic pea berry mm -hmm. and Sumatra, Kenya double A to Jamaica Blue Mountain and to as well the most mystery coffee bean, Cope Luwak. What's so mystery about it? Uh, the whole year, you can only harvest about 300 pounds of a Cope Luwak coffee bean. And the bean gone through a special process. It's not strictly from the coffee chip. It's actually gone through a creature called Luwak. The Luwak will eat the whole cherry and the bean will travel through the digest system because the enzyme it fermented the bean be richer, sweeter, smokier and nuttier than any other bean in the world. Wait a second. So you're saying this animal the animal poops out the coffee bean yes. and then people collect it and make yes. it into coffee? Yes. So since it's so hard to get, is it very expensive? It, right now the current market retail for the roast one pound coffee we are looking at about 720 to 740 a pound. Um, at any given time, we will have a one pound in stock. I buy the green bean directly from south south part of uh, Sumatra Island, Indonesia, from this farmer. He specializes in Kobe Uh Because I buy directly, uh, there's no counterfeit. I guarantee the bean to be a real Kobe Luwak. It's not from any other country, but it's from southern part of Sumatra Island, Indonesia. Well, can I see how it's made? Yeah, sure. By using siphon, we control the dimension of the tube. Using the, the dimension of this uh, siphon tube that allows the water molecule to expand up to 190 degrees to 200 degrees. Once a water molecule expands, they're forcing the water upward. Then we pump purified oxygen into the upper glass jar to begin the extraction process. Once the extraction process is complete, we cool it off with a moist tail it off and the reverse suction suck the coffee back down because the by pumping air, air in there would create this whirlpool effects that wash all the flavor out all right here we go it definitely is very good it doesn't taste like any coffee I've ever had before for sure it's pretty good. It's good? Yeah, it's really good. People want to learn more. How can they get in contact with you? The easiest way will go through our website, funnelmilk.com. Uh, it has all our coffee. Uh, the future product we'll be carrying. Excellent. You're welcome. All right, well, I'm going to continue to nurse this puppy. I'll see you guys next time. Is the yeah.